The running intracuticular suture is placed first by bringing the first suture in a line parallel to the apex of the wound into the soft tissue and then out the intradermal layer of the apex of the wound. The first throw is placed entirely in the intradermal layer of the skin just beyond the apex of the wound. The next throw is placed opposite this and slightly overlapping, but not entirely overlapping the first throw. Subsequent throws are placed back and forth across the wound. The last throw is brought out the apex of the opposite end of the wound. The wound is further closed with steri-strip taping. The free edges of the intradermal closure are taped down snugly. Steri-strips are placed across the wound to prevent further tension on this closure during healing. Proper removal of the steri-strips necessitates using an adhesive remover peeling the steri-strips towards the wound and pulling straight up at a 90 degree angle to the long axis of the wound itself. With the intradermal, intracuticular closure, the tape over the ends of the suture are then removed and the suture removed with a gentle, constant pull on one end.